out on sunset this afternoon. It was a calm night on the Swan. I was flicking around the old favourite, the double clutch. This one was in 95, Azuri colour. I'm basically just winding in at a medium retrieve and giving it rips downwards every, I guess, few revolutions. You can hear my line roll is still busted. Big hit. Drag a little bit loose as you can hear. Started running towards the poles towards my left. Worried he was going to brick me. Able to nip it up a little bit. And I just had to really lean against the pole. And luckily I was gaining ground on him. I was just using four pound braid with eight pound leader on my one to three kilo rod. And as usual, my 2500 Stratic. Lovely Swan River Taylor measuring up to 41. Unfortunately that was the only big one of the night. I probably caught about uh, at least 30 other fish, but they're all under size or probably just on size. I'm heading away for a trip in a few weeks, so I decided to salt up the tail of for some bait off the beach. Really simple method, putting it in a garden bucket, dropping a couple of cans at the bottom and putting some paper towel. This is to allow area for the juices to soak up. Put a bit of alpha oil over, brick in a few holes. Then take off the fillets, pretty roughly filleted there. Put a bit of salt at the bottom, non iodized. Chuck your fillets in and pour some salt over the top. The more salt you use, the longer you can cure it. Sometimes you can just put a little bit of salt on there and it will just harden up the baits, particularly if you're going to use them in a week or two. I've gone somewhere in the middle here. Cover up your fillets and put it somewhere safe, away from docks. I know from experience. Again, you can salt them for as long as you want. You can even just leave them in the salt solution until you want to use them. I tend to salt them for 24 hours. So they're a little bit stiff, but they've still got a bit of give. I'll then backpack them. You don't have to backpack them either. I used to use just sandwich bags, and that worked fine. Backpacking probably just gives you a an extra couple of months out of them. You can see all the moisture down there underneath. After sealing them, you don't even have to put them in the fridge or the freezer. You can just leave them in your shed. A couple of nice baits I can cast off the beach in a few weeks. For more Perth Metro videos, please subscribe. Feel free to ask any questions in the comment section.